Anna's beauty, Africa's pride. The GMB stage has taught me that the beauty of an African woman lies not just in her face, but in the impact she's able to make in her society. I have been embodying compassion and empathy ever since childhood. At 12 years old, I visited Walewale Wale in the Northeast region on a church rural outreach. At 15 years old, I was in a boom in the Eastern region, helping them complete the construction of their school block. At this same age, I was adjudged a Yale Young African Scholar, a platform that seeks to bring together young and energetic African leaders to equip them with the skills that they need to build up their brands, communities, and the world at large. Now, two years ago, I started a reading club out of my home to encourage the young children in my community that they don't need to fear reading, but they need to love it. Now, the success of my reading club was seen by several organizations who donated books to us, and we have also been able to donate some of these books to the Akpafu Odomi EP School in the Oti region of Ghana. As a veterinary medical student, I embarked on the Happy Animals Initiative, a social media campaign to educate pet parents and give them awareness and correct pet management practices. Using this GMB stage, I plan to use this immense platform to advocate for rabies eradication after the competition is over. You've seen me perform these past few weeks, and I've shown you my resilience, I've shown you my passion, and I've shown you my uniqueness. And I hope that tonight is enough to convince you that you are one of me. Now, thank you all so much for continuing to cheer me on during this competition. And I'd like to thank my honorable judges for awarding me two awards in one night on two different nights, an honor that hasn't been bestowed on any of the other contestants. Ladies and gentlemen, if you would like to see Aiko in the finals, kindly pick up your phones and vote now. Thank you so much. Thank you. Thank you so much, Aiko. And that presentation was on why she deserves a spot in the grand finale. G-Body, what are your thoughts? You know, um, I'm a <laughs> some guy said something here that was funny. I'm a communications coach. So I do this coming from a particular place. One of the most difficult things to do, okay, is to come back from a stutter or a stumble. Most people pause. I have watched you throughout this competition. Not only have you come back over and over and over again, but you've shown that you are a young leader. Whatever comes out of this competition, Aiko, I have said it and I'll say it over and over again. Don't let it end here. You are gold to the world. You have what it takes and congratulations ahead of time.